So this is where I stay for uni. So as you walk in and open the door, this is what you see. This is just an overview of my room. So this is the door and then the first thing you probably will see if you look on the left when you walk in is these two. I got it for free from the TK Maxx treasure. So this corner is just where I keep my keys, my ID and a broken umbrella. That's the actual umbrella I use and then my bags. This is the only bag I actually ever use for uni. I used to use this one but it doesn't really fit much stuff. And then two of my going out bags. And then this really cute avocado tote. It's gone really dirty though so I need to wash that. And I also have a Jollibee tote from Jollibee when they opened their store in my home city. So that's that corner and then if you turn this way i bought those two hooks they didn't come with the account with the room and they're from b and m i think yeah they're from b and m and they're just so cute and i only keep my towel and a hoodie i normally keep a lot more coats on here but i decided to just put them in the away so yeah, I keep my coat here and this door leads to my toilet. I won't go into details, but it's actually fairly small. That's all there is to it. That's just me. Yeah, this is my sink. Ignore that cup. I was trying to water my plants. That's been there since my moving day. A soap dispenser, my toothbrushes, the sink, and I keep my hand towel there. This corner is literally just my shower. And not gonna lie, it actually is tiny because I have to close the curtains and imagine just, you literally just have to stand to shower. What I meant is that it just feels really claustrophobic because of how small the space is when you stand. And then that's it. Nothing special. That's what it looks like. Yeah, there's nothing really too special about it, just a regular toilet. Moving this side of the room is, you'll see my desk there and my wardrobe. It's not that big. As you can see, it's not that big. Let me cover this bit, but it works. So I keep all my shoes under here and then my PJs by here. That box to separate like socks and stuff. So boxes do come in handy guys. So don't throw them away. And I keep like plastic stuff for shopping there. I hang up my coat and then I bought this little organizer which is so helpful in Primark and it was only like 10 or 5 of it. Actually don't quote me because I forgot. So th this is really helpful to organize stuff with minimal space so so i only did try and minimize the clothes i would bring and only bring what i would actually wear so i hope that kind of gives you a rough idea on how big my wardrobe actually is and i wouldn't say it's too big but for uni size is quite decent if you move here is where my desk is this is literally all there is to the room in my opinion ignore the boxes from amazon there because i have more by there but i just need to go and recycle it so i'll start off with the top shelf here we have my recording camera that gives me a really nice vintage old school video recording these are the books i got from the book club because i'm in a private com so they have clubs so i joined the book club and they give us free books every month those are the three i signed up for a water bottle which is really cute it's from wh smith and not gonna lie it's pretty expensive but i kind of just bought it because it was a cute bowl <laughs> This um, like coffee cup, I guess, is I want it a freshers and I just, I don't use it. I just keep it as a souvenir. And then in this side is just my miscellaneous. So I keep my false nails here, my LED box, cause just in case I want to put this away, two nail polishes, hand sanitizer, rubbing alcohol, my paper clips and stress ball that's in there. I keep my hair ties here. And then just a few like odds bits and bob, like my study planner, which I don't really use. Rich down, pull down that book that I bought here and it ends with us. If we go down here, I have literally this space here, which I don't know what to do because I like it all compact and tidy. I bought this organizer from TK Maxx. So I don't know if I can link it down below because they normally just have what they have that time so 
I separated my like moisturizer, aloe vera gel, moisturizer for my face. I used this, which is running out. Um, my deodorant, two hairbrushes. Back here is just all random stuff I can't rely on you. So pimple patches, pore strips, my medicines and stuff like that. Here I have another moisturizer. This, I just kept the box, but it's this one. This tiny little perfume, which is literally so nice. I use this every day and it's lasting me quite a long time. Please ignore my nail. I swear I keep my cotton buds behind there for my makeup I don't use it for the ears because it's really bad for you And then if we move here, this is where like my uni area is So I keep my law book here, which is the only books I have in like physical Some papers, my pot of pens and highlighters This is like where all I keep my wires So in here I'd keep like my charger and stuff if I need to bring it out with me outside If I'm gonna go to the the library or something. My clock from Miniso and a really disgusting lip gloss that I probably need to bin and my hair clip. I forgot to mention I used blue tack for these fairy lights because I didn't have tape at the time so yeah that's what it looks like. This is my actual desk. I'll start by here. I stuck these pictures behind my laptop because it, I don't, I couldn't fit it on the board. I bought this lamp with me thinking there wasn't going to be any light, but if you turn this on, it's actually really bright. So I don't really use that, but I do sometimes if the, this light is really hurting my eyes. So this is my setup for my laptop. I've got the stand from Amazon. I'll try and link it down below if I can find it again. But the last time I saw it, it was out of stock. And then I need to use this. There's the keyboard. I don't want to buy a really expensive one because student life. <laughs> I bought this on Amazon Day Deal and it works better if I wire it. So I had to get a USB to USB-C because the MacBook only has two USB. SBC port and that's it so I needed to convert. These are just my glasses and AirPod case and a few sticky notes. I need to sort the wirings out for this because it just makes everything messy. Oh and I bought this mouse as well. It lights up as well and I bought this from Amazon as well. So my laptop setup is all from Amazon. The stand, the keyboard, the mouse, the mouse mat and the converters. And then on this corner we have my filter jug which I keep there just to get it up the way. And then this I got it as a gift but i'm pretty sure it's from miniso and it's like a little light which lights up which is so cute in the dark so that's there and i just keep it just there and then this flowers i got from valentine's day i bought a vase 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 whatever you want to call it and i kept the ribbon from the flower to just tie up I'll try and link this lace down below and it's quite taller than expected and then down here we just have my three drawers and on the chair i keep this blanket because it's not one of those swivelly chairs it's the hard ones so just for extra comfort i decided to keep my blanket there and then right at the opposite side of the desk we have a full length mirror which is really nice so this is my fit today i only had like a lecture and a seminar so it wasn't that much of a long day and then on here we have my photos which is really cute yeah i wanted to keep half the board photos and half the boards like if i needed my notes to go on there so i kept that empty this is really handy because it's like a pin at the back but then it doesn't damage the picture by stabbing a hole in it and if you turn at this side of the room is my bed area i don't even know what's called that the headboard but i keep my head there because of the plugs so when i charge my phone so, so let's just go into here First we have my perfume and jewelry stand. These are all empty. I just keep them there. And my Vicks <laughs> and my cute earrings from my boyfriend. This is my LED switch. And here is just my necklaces. Just random stuff to be honest, like nail stickers. Here, keep my earrings, headbands, and just loads of stuff in there. Here is a trinket box and I keep my watches in here. My rosary. And then the cards, these two cards I got from family friends before I left for uni. So I just keep them on there just for motivation and this is the card that came with the flowers yeah isn't it so cute here i got from my friend for my birthday which is a little rj um pong pong from hmv pretty sure that's what it's called but isn't it so cute so i decided to just put him there and then my roses dead roses and i also got this vase from amazon in this corner i have random shit in it so my little avocado heat pack which i got from a friend as well they know i love avocado <laughs> so i just keep that there and then this lemonade moroccan spice i need to put in the kitchen some sweets and that's pretty much it and i keep the rest clear 
So this is just an overview and I forgot to mention that there is a light at the top of the bed that you can switch on. And then along there is just my LED strip. So if I turn it on, it looks like that. It adds ambiance to the room because uni rooms, you just need to make it aesthetic as possible. So I decided to buy LED strip, which is also from TK Maxx. And I have this little cute chimney and here in this corner is where I keep my junk. I have an ext extension cord. This is my ironing board. These are my resistance pans and then my yoga mat just sitting on there and my rice because it doesn't fit in the kitchen so this is just an overview of my room again Thank you.